Have we ever had a threesome? Ooh. Some of you guys might not be expecting this answer, but if I was to say to you right now, let's have a baby, would you say yes or no and why? We've been seriously having the baby conversation. The talk, we've been having the talk. I would say... <laughs> Good job, Kylie. You're doing amazing, sweetie. Go, Kylie, go. Go, Kylie, go. Look at her go. <laughs> okay, the question is, is this bath going to overflow and be too hot for me? Because for some reason, girls like their baths hot. Like, to the point where it's like scalding your skin hot. No, that's good. That's good temperature. That's good. Fun fact, last time we had a bath together, the whole bath overflowed <laughs> because of when Harry got in. <laughs> in Dubai. That, that was Literally the, overflowed. That was the moment where I thought, yeah, I need to start working out. <laughs> I need to start working out. <laughs> Got like stable, doesn't it? <laughs> oh, Jesus. So you guys are probably wondering, why are you in a bath? And the answer to that is we have a bath at home, but it's not this bath. This is a very, very nice bath in a beautiful hotel room that we wanted to basically sit in, get naked. And answer some TMI questions. <laughs> because the last time we did this, the last TMI questions we did in the car, you guys loved it. So we thought, how can we make this more TMI? Mm -hmm. Let's get naked. Not naked, naked. No. And get in a bath to make it more TMI. I think it's the most perfect bath ever. I feel so cozy. And I feel like if you guys want to run yourself a bath as well and sit in the bath and watch us sit in a bath. You should do that. You should do that and yeah. join us. Yeah, <laughs> we can all have a bath together. That sounds really weird. Yeah, maybe not. No, don't do that. <laughs> I'll go over here a bit more. Oh. So we did put a poll on our Instagram stories asking you guys to send in some TMI questions because we were just going to ask each other. But we thought, why not get you guys involved? And you guys sent in some, some interesting stuff that we are not going to include because if we do, YouTube will probably demonetize us and we won't be able to upload videos to you ever again. But we are going to read them out because I can't not read these out. These are so funny. Let's read a few out. Have you ever done it? Are you very vocal in the bedroom? <laughs> Does Rosie like it when there's rice pudding in her mouth and all over her? Meaning rice pudding, something else. You guys can, you guys can wear that out, don't worry. <laughs> God, this one. Does Rosie have a tight <laughs> What's Harry's <laughs> size? Why do people need to know this? This is so TMI. Like, when we ask for TMI questions, you guys are giving it to us. Yeah, we didn't expect to get this TMI, but yeah. you guys, you guys clearly want to know some stuff. So stay tuned for the rest of the video because we are going to answer some very TMI questions. But before we enter the video, guys, if you haven't already subscribed to our channel, we'd really appreciate it. And if you haven't liked this video, it helps us out so much. By liking the video, we get out to so many more people. So <laughs> like the video we love you forever please like the video please <laughs> oh. <laughs> okay question number one who has the highest sex drive out of us both that's a good question i'd say we're very much even if, if we had to say one person I, we're equal genuinely i'd say we're very like very similar when it comes to we are. being intimate although when i was on the birth control pill oh, oh, oh. i did not want to yeah. be intimate at all i like, thought you were like i thought you forgot i had a penis <laughs> So yeah, when she was on the pill, that was a bad time. It was really bad. It's like I feel you lost like your sex drive completely. So much. I feel like if any other girls are watching this and you are currently on birth control or you've been on birth control and you don't have a sex drive, I'm here to tell you that that is normal for being on the birth control pill, uh -huh. but it's not normal to get yourself off of that pill and back to your normal healthy self. Have we ever had a threesome? Ooh. Some of you guys might not be expecting this answer, but no. <laughs> I don't know what you guys are no expecting. No way. You think we're having a threesome? No way. Some... I mean, each to their own. Everyone has their own preferences, but for us, it's just us. No. Unfortunately, <laughs> no, not unfortunately. Unfortunately. <laughs> Quite a simple question, but one that a lot of people ask me on my Instagram. Did you lose your virginity to each other? Okay. No, we no, didn't. No, we didn't. We didn't. When we met, I was 19 I was and you were 21. 21. We weren't each other's first relationship, no. which is obviously completely normal. And yeah, we had been with other people before we met each other, which is shit to think about, but it is just part of life. You, if if, you I, knew, if I knew I was going to meet Rosie for the rest of the, the since I was 16. 12, 16, then yeah, I would have never had a relationship. Exactly. But yeah, we did. <laughs> That's the answer. That's the answer. <laughs> You're sweating, aren't you? Yeah, but it's just really this hot. This isn't hot though. Guys, put down in the comments. I'm interested if any couples are watching this together. I guarantee you this is the thing. The girl has the hottest bath. And showers. And showers. Mm -hmm. And the guys like, what is that? I don't know. Why do girls You've have some kind of beads of sweat dripping from I'm your I'm really eye. hot. Why you why do you need it that hot? It's not it's not a kettle. Question number three. If I was to say to you right now, let's have a baby. Yeah. Would you say yes or no and why? I would say 100% yes. <laughs> <laughs> I already knew this. I already knew this answer, but I wanted to answer it for you guys. I feel like and why? Over the last year and a half, we've 
been seriously having the baby conversation. The talk, we've been having the talk. Yeah, that's why I felt so comfortable to come off birth control as well because we both knew it in the position that if we did fall pregnant, we would 1 million percent love this baby and feel ready for this baby. Mm -hmm. It's got to the point now where we both are just so ready for a baby. We, we just have some big things coming up, like moving all the way to Australia and stuff. So and I think we kind of need to wanna, like, yeah. get that out the way first. Yeah, yeah we need to get that out the way. If you guys are new to our channel, this is the first time you're watching us. In five months time, we're moving to Australia. We currently live in the UK. I was born and raised in Australia and we're both moving out there in five months time. It's where we've always wanted to be. It's where we wanted to raise our family and seeing as we're in the point where we want to start potentially raising a family, it's the time that we've thought about moving. But the short and sweet answer is, you do want a baby and yes. And for me, exact same. Exactly. Exact same. Has Harry ever helped you shave down there? Oh, <laughs> many times. <laughs> Harry's helped me reach areas that I struggle to reach. Sometimes you have to like stand in like weird like positions to like get yeah. everywhere. Sometimes if you have a man that you're willing to let loose down there. What is the most awkward thing that's happened when you're both getting into it? I personally can't actually think of anything. I don't know if you can. Apart from the fact that sometimes our dogs seem to more like get oh, our dogs think that we're playing. And our dogs love humping each other. I'm gonna put a video in right now. This happens every single day. Our dogs hump each other yeah, 17 it's a, times it's a day. Play thing. As a playful thing. They're both girls, so it can't happen. Yeah, they they so, can't make a baby. But so when they see the same action happening with <laughs> us, they think that they think that we're playing. <laughs> and, then we're playing. and they get excited and try and join in. Uh, I think once before, I don't even know if I've told you this. Once before I did fart. Where? Where? Maybe six months ago. Really? You didn't know. A loud one. Loud enough that I knew that it happened. <laughs> I'm joking. Okay, this isn't a very TMI kind of question, but it kind of is because we've not really spoken about it. No. When are we getting married? Oh, okay. This has actually been a more conversation we've been having recently. Yeah. We've said for now that we're, the time and like the year that we're looking to have our wedding is probably 2020. middle of 2026. 2026. Still a little while away. Still a little while. Years. But the thing is that I've learned, we've heard from other people, like yeah. older people. This is why it's really important to talk to people that are older because yes. you can learn a lot from older people. One thing I've always learned is like, don't rush the most important things in life. Like don't exactly. rush to, you know, all these people are like, oh, he hasn't put a ring on my finger. It's been five years. It That's doesn't make it any doesn't matter. to it, your relationship. No, it doesn't. Right? And I see so many people complaining about not getting engaged or not getting married. Or, there's not enough special moments like that in life yeah. that you get again. Get there's your first certain, dog. Like, like moments in life and yeah. they don't happen twice. They don't happen really, enough, but then they don't happen enough, yet people rush when they do happen. Yeah. So it's like, just, enjoy it like we don't want to just get married for the sake of being like oh my god we're in our 20s mm. we want to get married and stuff like that no like i don't want to rush three it. years time i'll be 26 which is still like so young so to be getting young. married if you guys haven't seen our last video we did of rosie trying our wedding dresses mm -hmm. highly recommend after this video i'm going to put it at the end you guys should go and watch it because she looked insane in all the wedding dresses and it was actually <laughs> my first time seeing her and it was interesting it yeah. was like so beautiful so guys check that video out after this video do you wish that harry's penis was bigger <laughs> What the hell? Why are people asking these? That's a very TMI question, that but is like. so TMI. But I kind of want to know. No. Do you, do you wish it was bigger? No. <laughs> Let's just leave that one at that, okay? As long, Our as children no, no, no. might watch these videos back. No, all I want to know is no. No. All I want to know is no. Is this That's just it. a question you made up? No. <laughs> I've just got, I've got one more question on my list. Last question. Was the first time you ever did it awkward? No. We were both quite heavily intoxicated. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but no, I don't, I don't, it think, it, I don't think it was awkward. But I remember you feeling a little bit like, I don't know if you were like, I don't know, I, mm. I don't know if you were a bit shy. Okay, so I, like, this is quite like TMI. I haven't, re I hadn't been with like really anyone before Harry. So like, I was quite nervous. Well, yeah, like nervous. Like, <laughs> I don't know, I was nervous. It was shy. <laughs> it's so awkward, like, talking about this stuff. <laughs> it's just awkward guys. This is just like you guys I said this in our last video You guys seem to like TMI questions and you know what I enjoy it too if, it's I, funny. If, if I enjoy watching someone on YouTube I get interested in weird stuff about them So it's like I, I get why you guys like it, but when yeah. you're in this moment, it's so awkward It's weird, but like to it's, answer stuff. It's funny like I'm you're quite a closed doors person Yeah, but if you like know me in real life, I'm a very open type person aren't I like yeah. I will just say anything to anyone but guys yeah. that is the end of our I'll tear my questions video in the bathtub. It I sure is. You guys have enjoyed it. Me and Harry have been sat here for like 45 minutes now, so I'm bit, surprised that the, I'm up. surprised that the water's still warm. It I'm not is. even like gonna lie. It's because I did do a little wee in it. No, you didn't. <laughs> I have fired a few times. No, you haven't. I have. Have you? I've yeah. not seen the bubble. I think I've actually shat myself a little bit. <laughs> <laughs> shat.
Anyway, guys, we hope you guys have liked this video. Make sure you hit the like button if you haven't already, and the subscribe button. And we'll catch you in another video. Oh, yeah. <laughs>